Hey, good morning again guys from beautiful Amsterdam. Today we are gonna go to the, you know, one of the famous Amsterdam uh, site, which is called the Heineken Experience. I think most of the people know the Heineken, you know, it's a world famous beer company and they have a headquarter over here and a brewery over here in Amsterdam. So we are taking uh, a tram. We bought a tram cart for 24 hours, unlimited travel on the tram. And uh, what you need to do, right in front of you, there's a central station. From there, you take the tram number 24 and it will drop you off exactly at the uh, Heineken Experience where the brewery is. So we'll check it out over there. Once we get there, I'll let you know how much of the ticket is and what you get out of that ticket, what is included in that ticket as well. So this is the tram that we need to take to the Heineken experience. People are getting on board. So right over here, the central station. And this is the tram we're getting in. All right guys, uh, once we get there, we'll let you know. So as you can see guys, uh, the tram is moving. And uh, over here, um, it's uh, almost half full right now, but it doesn't go directly to the hiding experience as many uh, train stops that we need to stop before we get there but the final destination is the Heineken Brewing Company so that's where we're going right now we're in the city downtown or the central uh, area of uh, Amsterdam and I'll show you right now look how busy that is right now And behind this right here, the St. Nicholas Church, the patron saint of Amsterdam. And right over here, that's where you catch your uh, boat tour, the river canal tour. That's where you take it. All right, guys, right, in, right behind you is the Heineken Brewery Company. And that's where I am. And all these people you see, they're going for the Heineken experience. We're going to go inside and make some videos, see if they allow us or not. But so far, so good. I'll let you know how much the ticket is. All right, guys, this is the Heineken Brewer Company. As you can see, over there, there's a sign. I don't know if you can see it, but I'll make another video of that. This is the entrance. And once you walk in there, you have the side over here. Welcome to the home of Heineken. And we're just gonna go in there. Looks like a cattle. Look at this, guys. It's 1950 said board cattle number two. Look at this, how big this cattle is, guys. All these Heineken bottles over here, guys. Look at this, beautiful. Awesome. So the beer was established in 1873, as you can see it over there. So guys, once you arrive in, uh, if you don't have a prior uh, ticket online, that you, if you bought it, you can also buy the ticket online, but you can buy the ticket over here as well. The cost of the ticket for two people was $42. Per person is uh, 21 euro, I'm sorry. Yeah, so it was 42 euros. And you enter your date, uh, the day you want to visit, and the time that you want to visit and then you pay payments over here. You can use your credit cards. And these are my tickets are right over here. So, okay. So guys, when you are here, if you're carrying a backpack or small bag or anything, these are the lockers that you gotta put it in. All right.
So once you scan the ticket, guys, uh, they will give you those wristbands. It means that you have paid for your ticket. And uh, this nice lady is coming over here. She's gonna scan the tickets. Hi. Hello. How are you? Fine. That's for you. And one more. All right. Have thank a good you. Time. Thank you. So the tour starts at 12:15, and all these people are waiting right now. And uh, once the you know tour starts, we'll go inside these these gates over here. So guys, right now we are waiting for our tour to start. There's still about 10 minutes to go. Uh, you can see all these people are waiting. Uh, and there's another tour going on in front of us so once they move forward the door in front of us will open up and then you scan your ticket and you go in just want to let you guys know that this is the band that you get once you get the ticket and then your your ticket is scanned the lady at the counter will give you this you know this wristband that you have to wear it will tell you basically the, that you have paid for your tickets so slowly but surely the people are gathering up over here guys you can see that one thing I just learned if you can see that when you know picture over there those horses were used to carry the beer kegs until 1965 that's pretty neat and uh, the first beer to arrive in the United States was Heineken and it's still the number one uh, foreign beer to sell in the United States is Heineken is everybody having a good day? Yeah, yeah so. have a great day. Okay, great. Are you guys ready for a Heineken tour? Yes. Yes? Ooh, you're not very ready. Are you guys ready for a Heineken tour? Yeah. yeah. Alright, let's go. Come along. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, the tour just started. Now we're following the guide. He's taking us down there. It's probably gonna give us a presentation. Right, let's hear listen to him. Guys, this is the golden medal that Heineken won in 1875 in Paris, International Paris Fair. Pretty cool. Alright guys, so the first presentation is over. It's pretty nice. Uh, we learned a lot about Heineken. Uh, Heineken won the golden uh, award during the Paris Fairs in 1875. And Heineken was the first beer after the uh, U.S. Probation, prohibition, the alcohol prohibition, which ended. Uh, Heineken was the first beer to arrive in the United States, and it's still the number one imported beer in the United States. You can see how many people are behind me. Everybody's excited. Now we are going to the second stage of the tour right now, and there's. So you can see these uh, stairs. They're leading us to the silos where they keep the barley. Pretty nice. Okay, this in front of you guys is the person who started Heineken. His name was Gerard Adrian Heineken. This is the letter that he wrote to his mother in 1863. And over here, this is the original brewery first stone laid by Adrian's mother in 1867. So 
And this is the earliest price list in the 18, 1900 price list. It's pretty cool. The original brewery over there. Adrian built in 1868. These guys were the master brewers of the Heineken. Amazing. Over here is the Henry Pierre Heineken. He was he was appointed in 1914 as a director of Heineken Company. He was a chemist. I guess that's what the worker used to wear. And this is a ceramic beer time card. Awesome. These are the original kegs. Oh. So here he is, Alfred Freddy Henry Heineken. And he won the prestigious Advertiser of the Year Award. 1995. Some of the kegs of Heineken. And they're getting the national recognition. He won the Royal Honor, the Frederick Honey. Different bottles of Heineken's. That's how they started. Then went to this. Into the Pilsner. Look at this. This is how it looks like right now. It's fresh. So why also we eat hops? Because it gives our beer um, bitter aftertaste, and it uh, gives our beer this beautiful foam layer on the top. And you don't have to wait. It takes days. about 28 days to wait, be, make a beer. Minutes and you will try your first beer. This is what the lady just told us. So that's it. Oh, look at these big cattle guys. Wow. Just look inside of this right now. Oh my god, look at this guys. Amazing. These copper kettles. This building has so many beautiful stained glass windows as well. It's amazing. Guys, look at these uh, big cattle, uh, the copper cattle where they basically put the barley and uh, over here they make the beer. This is how it started, right over here, in the good old Holland. Amazing. All right, guys, right over here, it shows the process. So milling, you know, all the barley comes down and it mashes, lottering, boiling, cooling, fermentation, lagering, and then you have filtering and bottling. And guys, just look at this. Just look at these beautiful cattle. Amazing.
simply amazing. Alright, from here we go up again. It's a long process, I guess. It's totally worth it though. The 21 euro that I given, it's totally worth it. It's like a must thing when you come to Amsterdam, the Heineken experience. It's a self-guided tour, guys. Uh, some spot they do have uh, the guys explaining you. to get a more experience of Heineken. All right. This is amazing guys.
funciona de eso. Roll. So we're in another room, guys. The another room is closing. And they're gonna show us something else. Good dance music. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we're going down now, guys. So, from here, I don't know where I'm going. Just like you guys, this is my first time. We're following the stairs. We're going down. Famous star of Heineken. Come over here now. And this is probably gonna show us some other important information about the process of how to make a Heineken. Over here, guys, uh, you can have your own personalized bottle. It costs for one bottle is what seven pound seven euro fifty. If you want to get two personalized bottles, you can pay six euro per bottle. And over here you can come, it will give you the instructions. So basically, whatever you want to put on these bottles, you can put it on. That's pretty cool. Um, so guys, I made myself two bottles, personalized bottles over here. And once you do that, it's going to cost me 12 euro. You go over here and then you pay by the card. So for two bottles, it's gonna cost me um, 12 euros. Okay guys, this is my receipt that you have to present this receipt for your personalized bottles. And downstairs, once, the, uh, once you get down, they will give you your own bottles. Alrighty. Look at this cool artwork, guys, with bottles. It's pretty cool. All right, guys, once you come out of that area, right over there, uh, you come in and you take your, there's a picture booth that you can take your pictures, select your own background. And then you can also do this uh, karaoke. Uh, you can sit down on that and, you know, sing the song. And all these pictures and that movie, you can transfer it to your, uh, you know, that video, can, they can send it to you as a souvenir on your email or you can get the barcode scan and it will come right to your phone. This is another place, right? That's pretty nice. Right over there. Uh, the star of Heineken. So it's all about the non-alcoholic beers.
this is another rare another place where you can go and experience a different type of uh, Heineken championships that they sponsorships that Heineken has done So these were the jerseys, Ronaldo's jerseys, Figo, Maldini. So we go down from here, guys. So this is where you come in guys, once the tour is over, you come to the, this damn bar, right over here. Music is playing, people are enjoying their Heineken's. Uh, in order to get your Heineken guys, when, remember that uh, wristband they gave you? It has two tokens on it, so I'll show you that. You present those tokens off the wristband and you get one Heineken beer. Alright guys, this is the token that it comes out of your wristband. You present this to this gentleman, nice gentleman, and you give it to him. And for each token you get that, one beer. So this is the bar guys at the end of the Heineken tour. This is, uh, the, they call it the Dam Bar. And people are enjoying their cold beer. So guys, this was the Heineken tour. Uh, I hope you guys like it. Uh, right in front of is the Heineken store. Uh, I'll show you. And uh, it was pretty nice. Actually, 21 euro, totally worth it, in my opinion. I think uh, it's 4.5 out of 5. Pretty good experience. So this is the uh, Heineken flagship store. You can buy a lot of souvenirs from here. It's pretty cool. Obviously the prices are a little higher than what it's supposed to be for four glasses of Heineken is uh, $11, 11 euros and 95 cents. So after the Heineken store, you come out over here, it's still going on. Um, so guys in this store some of the items are very overpriced this is my personal experiences uh, one t-shirt is like 30 euros uh, maybe they said it's a reasonable one that's why it is but uh, I, I don't think it's uh, it's worth it a small t-shirt for 30 euros but if you want to buy it it's your choice um, I would wanted to buy this one uh, this hoodie but it's a little too expensive you can see the price of this that's a little too much 50 euro for a hoodie that's uh, I don't know a little too much for me okay this is where you go and pick up your bottle all right I hope it comes up over here Thank you. so this was uh, where the I thought it was you're supposed to pick up your bottle but not really over there you see that tour bottle pickup that's where you pick up your bottle from all right guys we got the bag um, pretty simple process you enter your code and you, they ask you if you want to have your bags and leave and that's what you say you do and the locker opens up you get your bag 
and now this is where you pick up the bulb hopefully they have my ball ready let's see what happens pretty nice bicycle with Heineken all right this is where Heineken creates bottle pickup service is Alright guys, this is my receipt and this is where you pick up your specialized bottle. I'm fine. So the lady's picking up my bottle. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. So just so you know, if you're taking a carry-on bag, then you should empty them beforehand. And if not, if it's like just a regular cabin luggage, you're more than fine. Okay. So, would you like a bag with them as well? I would appreciate that, please. What is this? This is the bottle your own. So basically, you can either request directly uh, to have your own bottle be made with your name or whatever you want written on it. And you can also do it throughout the tour. So. But you can also do it throughout the whole tour if you want to. So if, it, if you've already taken the tour or no? We have taken the tour. All right, thank you so very much. Then, thank yeah, you. here you can all. You take care, sir. All right, guys, this was the end of the Heineken experience here in Amsterdam. And uh, I got my personalized ball now heading towards the city. I talk to you soon. I hope you like it.